Bag secured. Let's see if it can even fit in this thing. All right, we're on our way to Hammers right now. We got about five hours left. Uh, we're actually gonna hit LA and pick up my brother, and then we'll be heading straight to Hammertown. So, long drive in the Cherokee. It's windy out today, but we're doing just fine. All right, first fuel stop on the trip, and uh, let's see what we got for mileage. So, we just went about 200 miles, put in 13 gallons of gas, 13.4. Okay, we just picked up this huge ass trailer. All right, we're rolling into Hammers right now. We got about 20 minutes until we get onto Boone Road. We're rolling in uh, a little bit later than we wanted to, so it's probably gonna be impossible to find our spot. We already have one set up. We're gonna give it our best go. Uh, and it is freezing out, so this is gonna be great. This is one of the coolest rigs here. We've seen all the other ones, but this is pretty sweet. Gambler 500 build. Uh, <laughs> you probably put a bigger turbo on it. And it just on it. Got to like 20 degrees last night. Yeah, it's been below freezing every freezing. night. Yeah, it's pretty bad. So uh, we got this thing here. This is a smudge pod or an orchard heater and uh, it basically runs on used oil. Right now we have vegetable oil in it and it's from a Chinese restaurant, so it smells really delicious. It makes me want Chinese food. Yeah, egg rolls. Yeah, uh, but it's working great, keeping us warm and- uh, Puts off a lot of heat. Yeah, and we're gonna go out and see the festivities tonight, so yeah. All right, we're here at Chalk of Thunder. It's like midnight right now and it's complete madness. He's the hype man. Back at Chocolate Thunder the next morning, and we're doing something that we shouldn't have to. We're picking up trash for people who are too stupid to bring it back out with them. It's a dusty day, but we came out here nice and early, about like uh, 9 a.m., and we got some big bags of trash. Woo! Doing our part. I mean, how hard is it just to take your shit out with you when you leave? It's 
it's gonna ruin it for everyone else. We're gonna hit back door, Thursday night back door, and see how that is. Okay, so it's like uh, late afternoon right now. We spent the day exploring Johnson Valley. We're a little bit far out right now. We're trying to find Aftershock to watch the race. And uh, it's going good. We're drinking some beers, having a good time, and we're pretty lost. So we're gonna keep exploring and we're gonna check out the scenery all around. Woo! All right, so that's a wrap on King of the Hammers 2022. Uh, we're about three hours left of our nine hour drive. Cherokee is doing awesome. We're getting like 13 to 15 miles to the gallon. Maddie's been driving for me, which is great. And uh, yeah, we're dusty, dirty, and we want to take a shower. We're so, excited to get home. Yeah, we're ready to get home already. All right, guys, it's the next day. We made it back pretty late last night and the Cherokee did great. I mean, that was like a 1300 mile round trip. We went from where I live in Northern California down to Los Angeles, to the desert, back to Los Angeles, and then back here. So a lot of driving on this thing. It got thrashed all week and did not break once, which is outstanding. And uh, yeah, I spent about half a paycheck in gas, but you know, that's just the price you gotta pay. I didn't get to film as much as I wanted to on this trip, and that's kind of because we were so preoccupied with the event itself. If you haven't checked out Hammers, I hope this video kind of gives you an idea of what it's like, and it's a crazy great time. So check it out, and I'm sure you'll have an awesome time. I got new content coming out uh, this week. I'm gonna try to get the taco 100% running, so hopefully I'll be able to take that thing wheeling soon, get some wheeling videos out on that. If you haven't yet, here's my plug. Like, drop a comment, and subscribe. So until next time, have a beer with me, and I'll see you around.